Hello Rapid Sale Buyers and welcome to the November Multi Consigner Sale. We have a beautiful Victorian porcelain Christmas scenery display to be sold by Absolute Auction through Rapid Sale Online Auctions. This is one man's collection of over 30 years of putting this collection together for somebody to be able to enjoy. It's from a very prominent home in the Ancaster area and I'm just giving you a short little tour down here and then I'm going to introduce you to Mr. Dan Wentworth, very well known man from Wentworth County which is now called Hamilton Region and he's going to narrate his little project of 30 years. So. Um, I'm going to turn the camera to Mr. Wentworth now and he will just do a little introduction to introduce himself. And here is Dan. Hello there. Uh, I started collecting about 30 years ago um, with one church, one house, um, and one vehicle. And it fit very nicely on a, on a uh, window ledge. And then as years went by I added a little bit more each year and I had to organize it into three tiers. The top tier being more or less rural, the middle tier being sort of downtown, uh, and the front tier being um, the rest of the village. Um, <clears throat> so starting from one end to the other, Dan, can you let us uh, explain to everybody the scenery as we start from this end down here and proceed down across the table and I'll do the videoing and if you can just do a brief description of everything and the areas that we're covered here. Alright, <clears throat> um, this is the um, latest part of the display. It's Everything is centered around a park starting with the pub and the uh, beer wagon with its bringing the beer and uh, we have a casino and the grounds are kind of fancier around the casino and then there is a sawmill and then a wood carver shop and then a bakery and then three houses here at the front that are more or less on the beach and there's a light in the next section which is the one around the front there's a lighthouse, skating rink, the casino again. Uh, up, up in the second middle section is the school with all the kids in the, in, in the courtyard, schoolyard. <clears throat> and then a gift shop uh, with uh, people, coffee in front, fire hall. Oh yeah, and there's old Santa Claus up on top. And the next is a library, which is as closest to City Hall as I've been able to get. I've got a town crier out in front and a fire department going by and then we have a park and there's a, <clears throat> a, sale, a, a newspaper salesman back there and uh, somebody feeding the birds. All the people gathered for the, the around the station waiting for the train and then uh, the second half of the park with the flower sellers and the, the kids in the, in the background, the uh, three built next three buildings are the stores, and you've got shoppers in, in front and uh, people that would work in the around there. Uh, at the top, uh, at the very end, we have oh, you're down by the <clears throat> one of the church two churches. There's a wedding going on. And uh, in front you can see the nativity scene, and, 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 and where you got the winery? Oh yeah, can't, can't, can't have a winery. You gotta have the winery in there, Dan. The winery, and out in front are the uh, winery, are the vintners, and some drinkers. <laughs> and, with, uh, and behind it there are some trees with there's a deer in one spot, and I don't know if you can see the bear. That's back there in the woods or not? Yes. Okay. And then do you want to catch the okay. front? This is the park here. There's a bandstand with the band in it. And 
people gathered in front to uh, listen to the music. Um, out right up on the far end, you have a cannon and a flag, and uh, there's various people sitting on benches. And, uh, Should we catch the front here, Dan? Okay, the front here. This is a flour mill, and you can see the guys with the wheelbarrows with the flour. And uh, in front of them are the woodworkers. And then you have uh, a store, another uh, store, fish market, I believe, there. Mm -hmm. And uh, a bed and breakfast. What's, what's that? Toy shop. Toy, another toy shop. Mm -hmm. And there's the mailman, postman with the, the, the letters. And, and, uh, and this one is a bed and breakfast. Mm -hmm. And uh, you can see the kids throwing snowballs at the oh, yes. people in the cart. And moving on. The, there's, the, there's the doctor with his, his specialty, and, and this is a... Cottage Inn. Cottage Inn, yep. Yeah, yeah, okay. And, and there's... What's that one? Uh, yeah. Just, I don't know what that one is, Dan. Um, L-O-V-E, or... No. Okay. I don't know. All right, that's a, a more a wealthier person's house. house. And... Uh, Another person's house with right, the right. welcome home for the holidays. There they go. You can see, see the... And another house there too, is that right? Yeah. yeah. Beautiful. Yeah, yeah, right, right. You can yeah. see them, all the busy activity on the streets also. Right. And then up at the top row. I don't think we have done that yet, Dan. Okay. So if we start down at the left and go right with the trees and the people. And another yeah. church, is church. it? Mm -hmm. right. And there's the minister. And his assistant up front, mm -hmm. and uh, coach coming into town, and yeah, carolers, carolers and waiting, and uh, the next one is the the rectory, I believe, mm -hmm. for that church. And again, uh, the a different type of coach coming here. There's the people waiting, and uh, the next is a. Uh, a vegetable salesman market type of thing, and he's out in front, and uh, more carolers. And this next one is a rural, more rural. Is that's a sort of a barn combined with a house? And you can see the little people bringing the, looking after the sheep and the goats, and, mm -hmm. and then uh, the old gentleman with his wagon coming along, and then the blacksmith shop. Oh, that's beautiful. Blacksmiths are working away. And, Next to them are uh, some deer, and a, there's a young lady feeding the deer, and then somebody on horseback bringing in the, the, the Christmas tree. Oh, very nicely done, Dan. So, ladies and gentlemen, that is a short narration of Dan's um, Victorian scenery documentation here. It is such a beautiful piece, one of a kind type of piece, that we will do up a count of all the items and put that in the description. But uh, here's one of a kind for somebody to have a really enhanced Christmas themed home. So ladies and gentlemen, here's your opportunity for a one man's 30 year plus collection and hard work. There's lots of scenery pieces and individual porcelain people, porcelain houses, buildings. It's just one of these situations that you'll never have another opportunity to be able to purchase it as one complete package. So nicely done. You get the tables, you get the display tables, you'll get all of the plug-in cords, like all the tables, the cords run from the buildings down, they're all lit up and they're all working before he set it up for Christmas 2020. So here's your opportunity. Ladies and gentlemen, enjoy your new Christmas Victorian themed village. I should point out to you. Oh, Dan's got one more oh, thing to say to you. The uh, railroad 
uh, does not go anywhere. It simply goes in, comes in and, and out of the village. Uh, you can, it will not, it will not work uh, as a, as a uh, toy. It is just for display purposes. For display purposes only. Yes. yes. So it's not a working railway. You included in our, our the, the cobblestone roads. You can see the roads. Oh there. yes. There uh, are over a hundred uh, evergreen trees and about 50 deciduous trees which are not shown in this display. So you have those in another box. Is have those in another box. So man oh man, what an opportunity for somebody. And again, thank you Mr. Wentworth for such a nice display <clears throat> and he's looking for somebody who can take it over and enjoy it as much as he has for the past 30 years. <laughs> enjoy folks and good luck.